everyone hope you're all doing well what I'm excited about is that the first video I'm gonna be putting up after a week is gonna be what a review giveaway guys Kondo was nice enough to message me and ask me if I wanted to review an oven an air fryer oven guys so I am gonna open this up it's so big the box is so big right now that I'm trying to get it on top of my counter to where I'm actually going to be putting it is hard for me to try and record at the same time but you will get to see what this oven looks like here's a little preview right there it looks like a little cube really cute with a round window in the front here's a little cookbook that comes inside you can make some delicious recipes just with the book over here it says pe pepper steaks but you know what you could do here right you could do pepper seitan we've got beautiful cauliflowers we've got kale chips where you could actually uh, dehydrate them right you've got blooming onions there's all kinds of things you could do and if it has any meat uh, recipes you could uh, change that to a vegan recipe so that is not a problem you've got scones you could try some of my re my scone recipes or you could even try one of theirs so i am excited to show you what this oven looks like so you ready guys i'm gonna start taking the pieces out because this box is too big for me to put on the counter but here we go we've got a little well, it's not that little guys look at the size of it. so you could put a nice size pizza on this we've got a grill we've got a beautiful pan and one of you is going to get a chance to win this. Okay, so we've got, wow, I mean this is an oven oven. If somebody lives in an apartment and you need to go out and get an oven, look at this. It comes with all kinds of stuff that you can use to do shish kebabs. This, I would probably put a large zucchini in this. Really, really nice. Okay. We've got all kinds of pieces, which I'm going to check what that's for later. And this is great. Sometimes you want to make a meal and it's only for yourself or for two people. Instead of turning on that huge oven, uh, you could always use this smaller oven. And the best part is it also air fries like my oven. I, my stove actually is not only an oven, but an air fryer, uh, an air oven, sorry. And this is the same thing. Okay, so let me look and see how this works. First time, as you can tell, this is the first time I'm using it. We're going to learn together. I'm not sure if you can see the whole. Let me see if I can zoom in a little. I mean, zoom out. There it is. That's the whole oven. It fits under your cupboard. This is the beautiful door. It's really kind of nice kind of has that old look to it and yet it's modern with all the digital uh ooh, i got some styrofoam oh we even have lights which we can't see right now because i have all of this in there so i'm just gonna pull this out i'm sorry this is really really nice and there's more pieces we have some kind of basket look at that beautiful i'm so excited there it is there's the door and if somebody is got a small apartment and they can't afford an oven you've got this unit and even if you do have an oven this is always great to have as a second oven this is exciting you want to make a small meal rather than using the large oven you can use this really you know what i'm not sure if anybody noticed i did i am so happy and i'm so proud of myself really uh i've reached over just a little over 90,000 subscribers and I said to myself when I get to 90 and 100 I want to be able to give a couple of nice gifts to my subscribers just to say thank you and Kondo made one of it happen right now I got back from the country and when I saw that I was so excited so I can't believe I got there it took a, it took me a while but I got there like I feel like I'm gonna cry because I I really enjoy doing what I'm doing and you guys make me really happy and I love creating dishes for you and it makes me even happier knowing that you guys love what I'm doing. So I don't want to get emotional over this because this is a gift. It's a giveaway. It made me very happy to know that I can give something like this 
to one of my followers. That makes me really, really happy. One of you guys are going to win this beautiful oven and they're going to send it to you. So thank you, Kondo, for allowing one of my subscribers to win this beautiful, beautiful machine. So I am going to check it out and see how this works. I guess this goes down at the bottom. This is your tray if you're making toast or anything that has breadcrumbs or even drippings. It's going to drip onto your tray. So that's what that is. That is a drip tray for sure. Uh, now I know what these things are. Uh, this must be a basket where when you do air frying, you see which piece goes with this. Like I said, this is all new for me, so I don't know right now. I am learning as I do this. So we have, of course, yeah, let me just put this aside for now. We have a rack. We have also a tray we can use. Wow, this is really, really nice. Can I turn the light on so you can see this? Okay, light. There you go. You could also probably use this on top of your. Okay, beautiful. There you go. And I'm excited to see what this is for. Let me just take a look. Is that okay? This must be to take out. Is this to? This is probably. Oh, there it is. This is to take out your tray. That's a handle. So it comes with a beautiful wire basket. I'm sure you're going to be able to put a lot of stuff in here. So you can slip it right in here. And then you've got your little pan that will pick up whatever dripping. You can put it further up if you want. And you can put it here. Nice little basket. This piece normally would be for chicken, but we're not doing a chicken. We could actually do maybe a cauliflower on here. We could put in a whole squash. But I just want to show you, you can actually unscrew it and then slide it out. Put this somewhere safe until you need it again. And this piece. Okay, this is where that fits. And now you could either fit the basket in that rod. You could, if it's right in here, that rod. You could fit the basket in here. Okay, so you have, are you ready? You have your rotating cage. You can use this for popcorn. You can use this for french fries. Then you have uh, your skewers. These are your skewers that get attached to your rings, one on both sides. Again, that rod would go in through that hole. There's two discs that you have here. It would be, okay, if I would take that rod out, you would put that disc there and this disc on that end. I'm not sure if you can see my arm is in the way. You see the discs? And then you have the skewers if you want to do shish kebabs. Or you can lay the shish kebabs right on the tray. You have a beautiful basket. You have a basket remover. So you can just put, there you go. You can pull out your basket and you're not going to burn your hands. How convenient is that, right? Beautiful. And again, you can take this out and you could put them back in. I mean, I'm not going to cook chicken on here, but I could put a large seitan roast in here and I can cook it on here on the rotator. Really, really nice. My God, what great pieces. Here, let me just open that up. You have these little screws that you open up. I'm not sure if you can see it. And then you could put this back in and there's your piece. 
and you can put either a large zucchini in there you could put uh, if you're by yourself you could put a corn on the cob on this and we'll cook it for you really really nice guys okay so we've got all these beautiful pieces it's already preset for you guys this is fantastic uh, veggies if you want to make a pizza already all you have to do is press and then turn on your oven this is crazy this is really amazing you got a rotisserie over here and then you have your on off button you've got your pause button so you've got already so many things that oh look you even have proof so I would have to go down to it just by look at that oh you could dehydrate oh this is exciting dehydrate you could proof bread cookies you could keep your food warm oh this is amazing look at this this is really something else so you've got all these presets over here you've got timer you could do your own if you want to uh, you have a light if you want to check in your oven and then you have the on off button like if I want to start dehydrating let me see let me turn that back on uh, go to dehydrating dehydrate and I guess I would press what to start um, oh here's a start button so right now I have it on dehydrating uh, setting and then you could pause it if you want and it automatically opens and closes for you oh this is great does it have toast oh yes it does have toast Oh, this is fantastic. Okay, we're going to put this on. Because we want to try to toast some bread just for fun, right? All right, guys. I'm excited for you. I really am. I'm only going to use one slice now. Toast, guys. Beautiful. All right. All right, guys. I'm going to make my husband's, one of my husband's favorite. It's one of the easiest uh, recipes you could actually make. We're going to start off by adding some red peppers. But we just take the core out of the pepper like this, and if there's any seeds, we don't go these are already cleaned there we go we've got some pepper we're gonna put we're gonna put some onion roughly chopped this is very alapaisana that means that there's like no finesse to it home when I say a la paisana that means uh, people that either your family or very close people they're not picky they're there just to enjoy a meal and it doesn't have to be very fancy okay we've got some beautiful beautiful oyster mushrooms these are already cleaned uh, there's no mycelium mycelium at the end so I am just gonna roughly throw them in if it's overly big then I will break it in half and I leave the attached butt because that gives it almost like a meat texture guys see this one's a little bigger so I could do this maybe two or three times and I'm gonna show you I buy a whole case of mushrooms at a time worth it every penny it's worth it okay I might put a little extra pepper I've got one pepper here that seems to be turning on me there we 
go. Very simple. And because in my family we're always trying to eat less oil, uh, my husband doesn't care. He loves oil in his dish. But if it was me and Erica now, uh, this would be done with no oil whatsoever. And because it's air fryer, you don't need that much. So I'm just going to put just a little bit. And I'm going to use a little bit of garlic oil, but not a lot. I thought maybe, I'd say a tablespoon of oil. Okay, we're going to put some salt. There we go. We're going to put a little bit of black pepper. When I say simple, it's simple, guys. Okay. A little bit of fresh rosemary. If you don't have rosemary, you can use thyme. If you don't have fresh, you can use dry. And we're going to drizzle some maple. Now, if you want to add garlic, you could do that too. But this is all you really need. Now, I am going to cook this in our beautiful oven. Okay, we're going to turn it on. All right. And we're going to put it right over the... Okay. And we're going to cook it on high. Now, here we have a choice of chicken. I am going to go to... Uh, where is the vegetables? Okay. I should have done that first. I'm going to change my temperature again because I cook everything on high. Sorry guys. 400. Now I go back to my timer and I'm going to also bring that up to an hour. Oh, minus. Okay, 60 minutes and I am going to press start. So I've got vegetables. I jacked it up myself to 400 and I'm going to press start. And that's all it is. So I'm going to see you after this is done and show you what my meal looks like. But I could put a ceramic dish in there and it's going to fit beautiful. If you have stuff in your oven and you need an extra oven, this is perfect. It is not only beautiful to look at, but it does what it has to do. And because it's an air fryer, what you can do is use less oils, guys and the whole thing is to eat as healthy as we can people say oils are okay well yeah oils are okay for the people that love to eat oils but a lot of us want to not put that extra calorie in our diet and we want to eliminate some of the oils this oven is perfect it does what it has to do so i'm very excited to see how this meal is going to come out it's a very simple meal but i'll show you what it looks like once it's done so i'll see you in a bit guys I just added some extra peppers in here but the ones that I had in earlier are almost done I mean this machine this air oven really works fast but wow this really saves in electricity if you think about it uh, because it's such a short cooking time uh, normally I have this in the oven for a long time but because it's working so fast I mean it's pretty awesome that's all I can tell you I still have 45 minutes to go and uh, it's doing its thing it's working faster than I expected it to uh, to cook in there and this is going to be done way before the hour mark so excited because uh, less cooking time less electricity when you use a small unit like this uh, pretty amazing machine if I say so myself guys Okay, so I'll see you in a bit and show you what this is going to look like. Okay, guys, it's a little noisy because I've got the fan on and it's cooking. But like again, I'm going to show you what this oven comes with. I am totally impressed. You've got, of course, your manual. It tells you how to use it. 
Uh, it also how to change the light. If your light goes out, it tells you what pieces comes with it. You've got the basket. Uh, you've got the rotisserie, which is pretty neat because you don't have to go out and buy an, a popcorn maker because all you have to do is put your popcorn in there and you're going to have popcorn in no time at all. So this manual shows you how to use it. And then, of course, it comes with a little book. And maybe I should just stop it for two seconds so I can, yeah. I'm just going to put it on pause so I can actually talk to you and you don't have that fan going. And again, it comes with some kind of creative little book and uh, it shows you some of the recipes that they have. So you can get very creative and you can uh, turn whatever meat recipe into a vegan recipe and they have a lot of veggie recipes for you. So. How fun is this? What I like about this is it's also a dehydrator. It's a dehydrator. Uh, you can proof bread in there. So that's pretty impressive. And again, it comes with, yeah, I'm going to show you. It comes with this beautiful tray. Of course, it has uh, the rack and the dripping tray that uh, is in my oven right now. I'm not going to pull that out because I'm going to burn my hands. These are all the extras that comes with the oven. Uh, like I said, you have this beautiful... Um, beautiful basket where you could put french fries in there and it'll just turn and toss as you're cooking it you could do popcorn in here uh, if you want to do and this is the piece if you're using your basket you simply unscrew this pull this out and then this is the part that goes into your basket and this is if you want to do a tofurkey you could do a tofurkey with this uh, you could also use this bar with these discs and you can use it as for like shish kebabs so you could do that or you could use these alone I put an elastic around there for now you could do your shish kebabs and you could put them right in your basket and just turn them by hand that's really up to you how you want to use your little oven so again I have to say thank you Kondo you're gonna make one of my subscribers very happy and I think this is a perfect review giveaway for my 90,000 guys come on share me on I'm so excited uh, I've been working really hard to get here it took me a long time I know I started way before some of the people that are up on YouTube and I finally made it so I'm excited not that I'm not excited for them I'm very happy for all of them who have succeeded here on YouTube but I'm happy that I made it to 90,000 I feel like wow what a what a what an accomplishment and so this is a very big gift someone's going to receive and I think it fits my 90,000 subscribers. So I'm going to tell you again how to participate on, uh, on this giveaway. Uh, you have to be subscribed of course, comment below the video, like the video. Again, every time you like my videos, it helps me, it pushes me up in the ranks. Comment below, that's how your name is going to get picked. And if you share it with your friends, come back, put a link, a separate link. That means don't use the same comment. Make another comment with the link telling me where you shared uh, your video. And that means your name is going to be uh, picked. It's going to go in twice for this giveaway. If you share it again, come back, make a new comment. And of course, your name is going to go in more than twice. So I'm going to say uh, good luck to all of you. And remember, this is only Canada and the U.S., unfortunately. But one of my subscribers, one of you guys that I treasure so much, because if it wasn't for you guys, this channel would never be possible. So one of you guys are going to win this fantastic, fantastic little oven. And it's great for a young person who's starting her life where she doesn't have maybe the money to get a big oven. That oven's going to do everything that big oven can do plus and this little oven does it all it really does and you get all these extra beautiful basket to put your cauliflower in and when you bring this up the air circulates all around these baskets and it's going to make your meal that much more beautiful and that much more delicious all right look at that yumminess can you see how beautifully cooked that is. I mean, he doesn't mind the oil, so if he wants to add more later, that's up to him. But just to show you, and nothing sticks at the bottom. Look at that. 
nothing sticks at the bottom. Your vegetables are done to perfection. What a fantastic little oven. Okay, just want to show you. This is everything you get. So if you want to be part of this giveaway, guys, remember you have to uh, comment. First, be subscribed. Then comment under the video. Give my video a like. And then share with your friends. The more you share, the more you come back and make a comment and show me where you shared it. Uh, your name is going to go in once, twice, three times. How many times you share it. Come back. Let me know where you shared. But you got to leave that link showing me where you did it and your name is going to be put in you have all the presets uh you have uh where you could change temperature you could bring your temperature up you could bring your temperature down you could change your timer uh the best part you could prove bread guys uh that's a that's a winner for me dehydrate uh being that i love eating raw uh dehydrating is a big thing also and not only for me eating raw I pick a lot of herbs for medicinal purposes and I, uh, I am able to dehydrate them and this is just a fantastic. So thank you Kondo and guess what guys, I'm going to wish you all good luck and I'm going to see you in my next video. Dinner for hobby guys. For more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to Connie's Rawsome Kitchen. Give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For more videos like this,